Erickson. Eric's gonna read a couple limericks, and then we're gonna get the. We're gonna do the pop next. We're gonna do a little. Uh, Cameron and Ian are gonna little do a little thing, and then we'll do uh, Ken's little autograph. Cool. Cool. Uh, that's it. Go, Eric. Thanks. So last year I wrote this book, Lim Eric, and if Ian had decided to retire a year ago, it would have been in the book. Right? Timing. Timing with everything. So I'm going to read this limerick that I just wrote about Ian <laughs> right now for this piece of paper. And then I'm going to read the two favorite limericks from the book based on the reaction that I got all year I'm reading the book all over the place. So, here we go. So Ian right now is retiring. On the field, he will not be perspiring. He was always a gamer, borderline Hall of Famer. His career, I would say, was inspired. <laughs> so, my favorite limerick in the book was one I wrote about Pat Vendetti. You guys know who Pat Vendetti is? He's the ambidextrous pitcher. He's like my favorite player of all time because he's the only guy who's ever been able to do this. And he's played in the major leagues each of like the last six years. He's not quite good enough to stay in the major leagues, it seems. He doesn't throw hard enough, but he keeps doing it, and he always gets a job because he's incredibly versatile. It's like having two pitchers in the bullpen, a left hander and a right hander. So I had this idea for a drawing of Pat Vendetti. We had this incredible artist who did the art in this book, whose name happened to be Art. And I said, why don't you do a drawing of Pat Vendetti throwing simultaneously with his left arm and his right arm? And he did this, a fantastic drawing, so then I had to come up with a limerick. So, whenever they need Pat Vendetti, his left arm and right arm are ready. He brings the team extras, because he's ambidextrous, with which hand does he eat spaghetti? <laughs> and, I, and we were playing the Dodgers, and he was playing for the Dodgers the night I wrote that, and I went down and asked him, and uh, he eats with his right hand. He does absolutely everything with his right hand. He's not even ambidextrous, but his dad taught him to throw left-handed when he was a little kid, knowing that it would be very valuable one day. So, you guys know that he did win a World Series ring with the Boston Red Sox a couple of years ago. We all know that he should have had one in 2011, <laughs> one with some other people. <laughs> and this is the limerick that's gotten by far the most reaction of any. And it was actually one of the first ones that I wrote. And the reason that we put the book together, and again, because Art James did this incredible drawing of Nelson Cruz, who got us to the World Series, of course, by practically single-handedly winning the ALCS against the Tigers. My feelings toward Cruz are complex. His homers soar several decks. He's kind and he's shy, but if he caught that fly, we wouldn't still have this damn hex. <laughs> I can't follow that one. But thanks to all of you who bought the book and followed the Rangers and followed Ian all these years. You know, we are so lucky to have a chance to watch him through most of his career. And thanks to Warstick for everything they're doing in the community and, and for youth baseball. And uh, for all of you, have a Merry Christmas. Do you have any <laughs>